Okay, so my garage doesn't have a remote, so I decided to make my own uh, with an ESP8266 module, uh, which is being controlled by a Raspberry Pi inside my house. So I'm trying to show this. So I created a little web app that's actually running on my Raspberry Pi. If you've seen this before, it's from my other video. So you know, I have, you know, like uh, I control my kitchen lights as well. So um, here I have. Uh, you can see like the temperature inside the garage. Uh, you can see the reflection from the house behind me. Um, temperature, the humidity as well as, uh, well, I think that's just a refresh rate, and then a little button that'll open the garage. So I click on it. Ooh, look at that. And then if I press it again, it'll stop, and then again, it'll close. Um, just controlled by an ESP8266 module and a relay. So let's take a look at what's inside. So I have a, a relay module. That this isn't my final uh, project box. Uh, I'll show what that looks like uh, later. Um, but you know, it has the um, the DHT11 uh, sticking out of the front, and inside there's a relay. You can see like these the, the red wires here are going into my uh, garage, um, the two opening port uh, terminals. So when the relay closes, it sends a signal to the or it connects the the two. Um, uh, terminals over there and it tells the garage to either open or close. Uh, it's, it's pretty simple so that you know if there's a connection it opens, if there's another connection it stops, if there's a third connection it closes and vice versa. So pretty simple. I'll um, put all this information eventually on easyprogramming.net. I'm just going to close the garage door from here. There we go. I know the button needs uh, some animation. There we go. Have a good one. So before I let you go, I just want to show you the UI on a computer screen since it does look a little bit better. So the garage tab is what I showed you on my phone earlier, um, where you see the temperature and humidity. This is the current temperature and humidity at 12.50 a.m. Uh, and this button controls uh, the garage door. I use MQTT protocol, so it sends the data to my uh, MQTT broker, which is in my HASIO, which is on a Raspberry Pi 4. Um, and it sends, uh, you know, the trigger, and once it does that, it, it does the, uh, the, the switch. So you can find all of this on my GitHub and on easyprogramming.net. If you have any questions, do ask. Um, and, you know, I've shown off my kitchen once before. Uh, it used to be just fully Raspberry Pi, but now it's Raspberry Pi plus ESP, and I have not done that with really, uh, show off yet, my show and tell yet. Uh, but anyways, um, just want to show this to you. It is mobile friendly, so if I do, you know, decrease the screen size. Um, you can see that I'm logging the humidity temperature every 10 seconds. Uh, you know, it does look a little bit better um, on a phone. It's just the better layout. You can see the basic bootstrap for that. Uh, anyway, so if you have any questions, do ask. Thanks for watching. Have a great one.